Hello, hello. Hello, hello, guys. Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. We can Hi, hear you. Claudia. Hi, how are, how you? are you? I'm a little bit tired. Really? Why are you tired? What, what happened? It's been a long day at work. Really? What did you do today? A lot of a lot of patience. Oh, wow. Hey, what's going on? A lot of money. A lot of money. I like that. I like that. Good evening. Good evening. Hello. Good evening. Hi. Welcome. Thank you very much. And I see that you're wearing red, and I am wearing red, too. We're, We're matching. We're matching. <laughs> <laughs> That's so cool. And how was your weekend? Um, it was great. We went to Los Planes de Renderos. Oh, nice. On Saturday to eat pupusas. And what what, what my family? What restaurant did you go to? Um, Casa Campo. Ah. Have you been there? I've never been there. I is it good? Yeah, it is good. It's, okay. And it's not that expensive too. <laughs> oh, I like that. And it, like that. the food is really great. Okay. And what did you eat? The pupusas. I ate pupusas, but but I've been there in another time, and I ate like uh sopa de gallina. They have to Mexican food. They have. A uh, very uh, variado. How do you say? A uh, variety menu. Uh, variety. Okay, variety menu. Okay. And it's good. Okay. Well, I'm happy to hear that. Welcome back. I hope that you have energy and that you recharge batteries for the class. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's, that's a good that's weekend. Good. Well, I'm happy. To and you? Back. Uh, in my case, on on Saturday, uh, your your brother, right? Is it was coming from Houston, right? Yes, no. yes, yes, yes. So Friday we went to Centro Historico. We oh, went okay. to a, a restaurant <laughs> called Pipiri Nice, and mm -hmm. we had Mexican food. And okay. That was Friday, and then Saturday, I went to Multiplaza to pick up a book. Uh, do you want to see my new book? Yes. I have a wonderful new book. I love it. I went to international books in Multiplaza. And I got yeah. the Think and Grow Rich edition, the Mastery Key to Riches, the Magic to Ladder. <laughs> and I got another book as well. So I feel so good. And then okay. on Sunday, I... Oh, on Sunday, I met Vicente because he... He gave me my new products for my company. He gave me this. Really? He gave me this. Um, You're making business. <laughs> yeah. Vicente, Vicente. Money, money. <laughs> Vicente is a businessman. Okay. <laughs> so he gave me this. Well, I bought it from him. Uh, this coffee mug. Oh, it says okay. Bienes y raíces El Salvador is my company, and then here it says I love AM Bienes y raíces El Salvador, and he, he gave me also a, a polo shirt, a polo shirt that says also a, it has. A.M. Right there. 
It's completely uniform. Yeah, it's, it's, it says AM Vienes y Raíces El Salvador. It's nice. It's yeah. nice. So I met with Vicente. We had a conversation. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah, right. Thank you, Vicente, for visiting me. And okay, no problem. Yeah. Anytime. Yeah, we had a good conversation. And I can say I had a very oh I, I am I am selling a house in Nuevo Lourdes. So I went to mm -hmm. show the house to the new clients. So I can say that I had a very blessed busy oh, blessed, okay <laughs> bendecido weekend. Okay. I That's met my right. friends. Happy for you. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. All right. Welcome back, everybody. Hello, Brenda. Hello, Eugenio. Hello, Maria. Hello, Juan. Hello, Luis. Hello, Oscar. Hello, Ada. Hello, Giovanni, Jennifer, Norma. Good evening, Mr. King. Good evening, good evening, Andrea, Noe, Olivia. Welcome, welcome, everybody. How are you today? Thank you very much. We are okay. Hello, we are hello. Ready to... hello. Hello, hello. Vicente. Yeah. Vicente is a businessman. Right, right, in yeah, Salvador, right. In, Sal in Salvadorian, I'm saying, <laughs> cachadita. Cachada, cachada. <laughs> cachada, cachadita. Right, okay. yeah, right. <laughs> Business mean money. It's an intelligent man. It's an intelligent man. <laughs> Thank yeah. you very much. Yeah, yeah. Okay, guys, I am so happy to see all of you. I hope that you guys had a good weekend. I hope that you enjoyed with your friends, your family, your loved ones. And I hope that you guys have energy for the class and with good vibes. Who can tell me what do you remember about the class on last Thursday, what do you remember? What can you tell me? Jaren and Sharon's response. That's correct. Jaren's with short responses. So I would like for us to review this topic uh, today, just so that we can go a little bit more into details and maybe give you some examples. And maybe you can give me some examples and practice a little bit. I like I like traveling. Oh, I, I like traveling. I, so do I. So do I. So do I. Good, good, perfect. Good job, Brenda. Let's listen, please. Listen, please. We go, we want you to agree on the following statements. I love hiking. I'm not good at swimming. Yes, we can hear you. Always okay. respond on our discussion box. I'm going to repeat the audio. Ready to know about Jaren's and short responses? Follow us in the audio program and stay with us for more explanation. Jaren's short responses. Affirmative statements with gerunds. I like traveling. Agree. So do I. Disagree. Oh, I don't. I hate working on weekends. So do I. Really? I like it. I'm good at using a computer. So am I. Gee, I'm not. Negative statements with gerunds. I don't mind working long hours. Agree. Neither do I. Disagree. Well, I do. I'm not good at selling. Neither am I. I am. I can't stand making mistakes. Neither can I. 
Oh, I don't mind. Other verbs or phrases followed by gerunds. Love. Enjoy. So, Claudia and Luis and me, we are coordinated wearing red today. <laughs> today is red t-shirt day. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Luis, also the also the lady the uniform the, uh, <laughs> yeah yeah I saw I saw Luis uh, Claudia and me wearing red <laughs> be interested in the people Let's in red parents. Yeah. remember a gerund is a verb plus ing today we will make reference to verbs or phrases that are followed by a gerund Okay, so this is something that you have to memorize, right? Uh, like, who can give me an example with like and a gerund? Like and a gerund. Liking is not correct? Uh, no, no. You can say, for example, um, okay, I like. Really? Watching TV. Ah, oh, yeah, 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 I know. Business books, for example. I like oh, yeah, I reading business books. So, like is the verb and mm -hmm. reading is the gerund. The okay, gerund. give me another example. I like I eating pupusas i like eating pupusas good job i like eating pupusas okay another example i like swimming on sunday very good i like swimming on sundays another example i like Speaking English. Yes, Maria Jose. Sorry, I like sleeping all day. <laughs> I like sleeping all day. Okay, that sounds like fun. No more coach potato, please. No more coach potato. No more coach potato, potato please. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Want to be healthy? You have to be activated. Okay, who can give me an example with hate? Hate and the gerund. I hate working on weekends. I hate working <laughs> on weekends. But I think for Vicente, I think Vicente, I think you enjoy working on weekends in your business. Right. It's my business? Yeah, right. Of course, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, another person, another example. Give me an example with I hate. It's okay if I say I hate going in traffic. Okay, you could say I you could say I hate going in traffic or I hate driving in traffic also. Okay. Okay. Good. Good. Another example with hate. I hate um, the raining when I'm on the street. Oh, okay. You could say, I hate being in oh, yeah, right. rain when I'm on the street. When I'm on the street, right. Okay. Who can Teacher, give I can you... say, uh -huh. I can I can say I hate being late at work. I hate being late to work. Correct. I hate mm -hmm. being late to work. Yes. Good. Okay. Excellent, Edgar. Uh, who can give me an example with um, good at? I am good at learning English. 
I am good at learning English. Good job. Yes, Edgar. Somebody else? I'm good at getting business. I am good at making business. Excellent. Making business, right. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. <laughs> Another example. I'm good at working hard. I'm good at working hard. Or for example, Mr. Santos, I am good at teaching English. Teaching English. Ada, she is good at making cakes. I good having cake. Yes. Eugenio, he is good at giving um spinning class. Exercise. Ah, okay. Or exercise. I yes. am good at uh, exercising. Um, giving is driving. I'm good, good at driving, driving to the beach. To the, to the beach. beach. Okay. All right. I'm good at giving instructions. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Hi. Hi. I have a question. Uh, yes. We can use in negative form. For example, I'm not good at eating uh, chocolate. Okay. Good. I'm not good at eating chocolate or I am not good at cooking in my case. It's not uh, my talent. Okay. I'm sorry, but I have a lot of problems with the network with the internet connection. Training here, power. Okay. All right. Uh, good job, guys. We're going to go ahead. I see that everybody understands this topic. Um, at this moment, does anybody have any questions in regards to this topic? Do you have any questions about the pronunciation? Questions about the meaning? Questions about vocabulary? Questions? Questions? Anybody? Teacher, no, I have a question. Yes, Claudia. Is there any difference between said neither, neither am I, or me neither, or it's the same? No, it's the same. It's the same. Uh, the difference is, for example, if I say to you, if I say to you, I am, with the B verb, I am mm -hmm. not hungry. I am not hungry hungry and then you say neither am i with the beaver mm -hmm. if i say for example i don't want to go and then you say me neither neither or me either because the verb is go okay Mm -hmm. Okay. So it just Thank depends, you, teacher. It just depends on the verb. Okay. Thanks. Of course. Okay, let's continue, guys. Todo me moje. No problem. Man. Um, you know, I want to look clean. I want to look nice. <laughs> Where? And comes the water. And make a destroy a mess. It's a disaster. Like. <laughs> okay. Uh, we're going to move forward and we're going to look at the knowledge check instructions. Uh, read the following phrases. Rearrange and use what is in brackets in order to make statements. Remember, the ing form of the verb. For example, I enjoy with time spend friends my. So the correct order is I enjoy spending time with my friends. So you will do one through eight. I'm going to give you a couple of minutes so that you can work with your partners. I'm going to activate so that one person can share your screen 
and I would like for you to share your answers. If you already finished, please help your partners. If you already finished, please help your partners. Okay. Uh, Ada, you have to click where it says ingresar o entrar. Uh, Saraí, Cecilio, you got to go where it says entrar o ingresar. Saraí and Cecilio. Thank you, Oscar. Thank you. Working in these services, hearts. I don't think it is. Um, the first one is I don't like commuting by bus, right? Let's see. Let's check. I don't like commuting by, by mm -hmm. The second is I'm not very good at learning foreign languages. Yes, I'm not very good at learning languages. Yes, right. Mm -hmm. Third one, I'm good at Solving other people's problems? Solving other people's problems. Yes, mm -hmm. that's right. I hate working with a group or team. For it. Yes, it's correct. I don't know if the fifth is I can't stand sit alone in a meeting. I think it's extended. I try, but I don't know what happened. Or I can stand in. Or I don't know who else is with us. Let's see. I think it's sitting. Sitting. Really? I think. I think that's the correct answer. Okay. Yes, it's correct. What is Brenda, number help yes help us. help us please i'm here <laughs> okay uh, give yeah, me I'm one I have problem i can stand sitting remember you remember you double t and stand only I can stand. Yes. Sitting. sitting. Double T, remember. Okay. Duplicate Sitting. the number the, the letter T. Stand. Can... Uh -huh. In in the long 
Yes. In a long. Yes, in a long meeting. Um, pilot, pilot. I come say se punto pilot. Yes. Pilot, right? Period. Period. Stop. Thank Period. you. Yes. Oh yes, I got it. I got it. Thank you very much. <laughs> I got it. That was my problem. I was trying a lot. It's a pleasure. Don't worry. Hello, teacher. I'm here with my friend, with my coworker, but she's doing some homework. Okay. And that's why he can't participate. Okay. Welcome, 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 welcome. Okay, who can give me the answer for number one? The answer for number one. I don't like commuting by bus. Excellent, I don't like commuting by bus. Uh, another volunteer for number two. Another volunteer. I'm not, I'm not very good at learning a foreign language. Very good. I'm not very good at learning a foreign language. Rain. Good, good. Another volunteer for number three. Another volunteer for number three. The number three is uh, say I'm good at problem solving other people's and the answer is I am good at solving other people's problems. Excellent. Volunteer for number four. Brenda. Yes. <laughs> Number five, Jennifer. I I hate working with a group or team. Very good. Remember the period. <laughs> the period, yes. Number five, Jennifer. I can't stand sitting in a long meeting. Good, good. Thank you, Jennifer. Number six. Volunteer for number six. Me? Me? <laughs> Sorry, I, I was alguien, mute. I was mute. Alguien, <laughs> alguien que no participado. Somebody else. Okay. Okay, good. Next Me? <laughs> Me, teacher. Okay, Maria Jose. Number the number six. I'm in I interest. Interested mm -hmm. in managing my time better. Very good. Number seven, Ada. Okay. I don't mind talking or a cell phone. Excellent. And the last one, number eight. The last one, number eight. Hey, Vicente, we're going to give somebody the opportunity. <laughs> Thank you, Brenda. Okay, good, good. Vicente. Okay, good, good. Quiero que los que no han participado, que participen. Edgar, once. Edgar, okay, Edgar. 
democráticamente, <laughs> Edgar. Edgar wants to participate. Edgar. Oh, Sarai, Sarai. I want to compete with with Vicente. I can see that. I can see that. Round one. I... <laughs> okay, Sarai, no. Okay, Giovanni. Norma, Olivia, Elizabeth. Come on, guys. No pueden ser los mismos participando siempre. Cecilio, Sandra, Andrea, Oscar, Noé. Cecilio. Ok, Cecilio. Eight. 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 I enjoy eating lunch out. I enjoy. Repeat. I enjoy eating lunch out every day. I enjoy eating lunch out every day. Eating lunch every day, every day. Out every day, me too. Every day. Me too, I never cook. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you guys. Thank you guys. Um, okay. We're going we're gonna to take the attendance. Okay, good. Stay present with energy. Stay present. <laughs> okay, let me see. 8 p.m. Okay, let me have Ada. Present. All right. I like it. <laughs> there is the 16. Okay, there it is. Present. Alicia. Present. Present. Excellent, Alicia. Eh, Elizabeth. Present teacher. Excellent. Andrea. Present teacher. Very good. Brenda. I'll be back. Brenda, present. <laughs> Round one. Eight. <laughs> Cecilio. Present teacher. Thank you. Claudia. Present teacher. Very good, Claudia. Edgar. Present teacher. Awesome. Eugenio. I'm here, mister. Very Ready good. to fight. Ready, Mortal Kombat. <laughs> Hey, don't intimate us. <laughs> Giovanni. Present teacher. Excellent. Jennifer. Present. Awesome. Juan. Juan Antonio. Okay, Juan Antonio absent. Uh, Lenin. Uh, Lenin absent. Lorena. Absent. Luis. Present. Very, I am very here. Very good, very good. Luis, Maria. I'm here, teacher. Excellent, Maria. Noé. Noé. Ahí estaba Noé, si yo lo vi. 
Present, present. Oh, thank you, Noé. Uh, Norma. Absent, Norma, okay. Olivia. Olivia. Teacher. Hi. Juan Antonio advice in, in chat is present. Juan Antonio, okay. Yes. Okay, this uh, Juan Antonio presenting teacher. I have problems with the audio. Buenos, I am here. Okay, Juan Antonio, Olivia present. Okay. So, Olivia present. Y Juan Antonio. Juan Antonio present. Okay. Oscar. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Sandra. Sandra. En el chat dice presente, teacher. Okay, gracias. Sandra. Okay, Sandra, presente, teacher. Good, good. Thank you, Sandra. Sarai. Present, teacher. Excellent, Sarai. Thank you, Vicente. I was mute. Sorry, awesome. <laughs> I'm here. Awesome, awesome. Okay, so we have absent Norma. Absent Lorena de los Angeles. Absent Lenin Hernandez. Absent. Tenemos tres absent hoy. Okay. All right, guys. Any questions uh, about this activity? Any questions about this activity? No question. No questions. Okay. Now, only, only in, in my case, when I write the, the answers, I I forget the period. You ah. why? What, what what is the problem? <laughs> but I I finished. Right. Yeah, for some in reason. In a trouble in my mind, but I I finished. <laughs> okay, okay. Thank you, thank you. Okay, let's look at exercise number five point five. Uh, in this session, you will notice and practice released and unreleased sounds. In esta sesión, notarán y practicarán sonidos que se pronuncia y otros que no se pronuncia. All right. Vamos a ver. Released. Da. Da. List and da. Uh -huh. Sound and sound da. Okay. Da. Hi, everyone. We want you to get better on your pronunciation. Please listen and practice as many times as you need to. Pronunciation. Unreleased and released. T and d. Part A. D. Listen and practice. Notice when the sound t or d at the end of a word is followed by a consonant, it is unreleased. When it is followed by a vowel sound, it is released. Unreleased. She's not good at math and Okay. So basically what this means is that if the next letter is a consonant, the the T is pronounced. I say, she's not good at math. At math. So I pronounce it. Here, 
he's not a good artist. He's not a good artist. Can you tell the difference? Let's start it one more time. Science. It is released. Unreleased. She's not good at math and science. I think it was mute. You couldn't hear it? Okay, let's repeat it. Hi everyone, we want you to get better on your pronunciation. Please listen and practice as many times as you need to. Pronunciation. Unreleased and released. T and D. Part A. Listen and practice. Notice when the sound T or D at the end of a word is followed by a consonant, it is unreleased. When it is followed by a vowel sound, it is released. Unreleased. She's not good at math and science. I hate working on Sundays. You need to manage money well. Released. He's not a good artist. They really hate it. I need a cup of coffee. On your own, complete the following sentences and say them out loud. Watch your pronunciation. Remember, the more you practice, the better you get. Okay, let's practice. It is released. It is released. Listen and repeat. She's not a good at math and science. She's, She's not, not a good, good at, math, at math, math and, and science. science. She's not good at math and science. I hate working on Sundays. Me too. I, I hate working, working on, on Sunday. Sunday. <laughs> uh, I like working on Sundays if it's my business. <laughs> if it's, if it's if my, my business, I love it. If it's if my, not business, my business, yeah. Itty bitty. <laughs> like that. Huh? Yeah. I like making. <laughs> okay. Uh, see, you need to manage money well. You need to manage money well. So I want you to notice that the. the Duh. Duh. is Duh. not very strongly pronounced but here repeat Duh. he's not a good he's artist not, he's, he's, not, he's not a good artist so he's here, not a good artist he is pronounced he is pronounced they really hate it they, they really, really hate it. They really hate it. So we pronounce the T. I need a cup I of coffee. I need a cup of coffee. I need a cup of coffee. I need a cup of coffee. If it follows a vowel, it is pronounced. If it's not, it is not pronounced. So your homework for this activity is going to be to practice the pronunciation. But that's going to be okay. your homework. Okay. Uh, now, unreleased. We're going to go ahead and uh, go on to the next activity, which is session 5.7. In this session, you will develop skill. This is the main idea. En esta sesión desarrollarán habilidades auditivas para entender ideas principales.
job hunting. Oh, that's another thing that I did over the weekends. I wasn't I wasn't really like job hunting because I have a job, I have a business, but I went in the platform Upwork, the platform that I was telling you about, and I found positions that pay $20 per hour. Oh my god. Yeah. Twenty. Yeah. I when, need you to business. <laughs> yeah, work. Go, go to the platform Upwork. It's on the Play Store. Upwork. Please uh, teach us. What? Upwork. Please teach us. I did. I told you the platform is called Upwork. <laughs> And that's the name of the platform. You have to go to Up Work. You have to go this to one. the Play Store. Let me see. Okay. Uh, UP uh, Layer Green. Yes. Uh, yes. yes. Up Work. Yes. For free right. land. Yes. Welcome, yes. Okay. We're going to look at right here. Section. And I'm going to put it in silencio, guys, because I'm hearing a lot of instructions. Listen to people talk about the kind of work they are looking for. Check the job that would be best for each student. Instrucciones. Escuche a las personas hablar sobre el tipo de trabajo que andan buscando. Marque el trabajo que sea mejor para cada estudiante. So, we're going to take a couple of minutes, maybe like five minutes. If you already did it, I would like for you to uh, share and compare your answers with your classmates. If you didn't do it, please do it now. Ready? Let's go. I answer already this this exercise. But we can yes, we finished. I, I okay. finished. But if I... you want we can make a review. And you, Cecilia? Finished? Please. No, you finished. You, I I didn't the uh, the platform in this case. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Um, only read the number one, and the next two, the next three, and the finish. Okay. Okay. Number uh, one. Okay, está bien. Number one is flight is attendant. Flight attendant, sí. Flight attendant. Yeah, because flight number attendant. two. Looking for a job. He Bill, wants to work. The better job is flight attendant. In number two, in my case, is Shannon. For me, is the better job doctor. Doctor. Right? Right. In number three, Ben, the better job for 
for her for he is model yes model 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 yeah uh, yes is is for better right. <laughs> okay let's move to for, the next <laughs> for, for my best better job i think a comedian <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, go. I think I don't know. Go ahead. <laughs> you can uh, get it. Uh, yes. Can I dream? <laughs> hmm? Only finish. Yeah, we finished. Is that's it? Easy peasy. Cecilio, Andrea. Sarai, finished? Yes, I have the same. Yes, okay. finished. Okay. Excellent, we got it. Excellent, good job. Yes, it's an excellent, good job. I think I need to listen to the reading. Yes or no? Yeah, we can. We're going to wait for everybody to come back because we still have a, a couple of minutes. Let me have the first participant. Who wants to be the first participant? <laughs> Who wants to be the first participant? <laughs> okay. Brenda, you are the first participant. Okay, no, round number one. <laughs> yes. um, for me in the reading, the better job for Bill is flight attendant. Flight attendant, excellent. Number two is Claudia. Claudia. Sorry, <laughs> I was with a doctor. Doctor, okay. Sarai, Ben. Ben, model. Model, good, good. Okay, we got it, look at that. Perfect. Got it, got it. Got it. Any questions in regards to this exercise? Questions? No. No? Okay. No question. All right. That one's pretty easy. So if you guys want to go job hunting for a little part-time, you can go to that platform that I sent you, Upwork. And there's Upwork. also another platform that's called Overpass. It's also good to to find jobs online uh, paying american salaries in a salvador overpass overpass overpass, it's, overpass. It's another, it's another i need i need a certification no 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 only english you don't need any experience no no, no only english okay. no more than english just english a lot of English, and a lot teacher. of money. Yeah. <laughs> teacher. Yeah, right. Yeah. No, that's no. the same that Mr. My big money, big money. Yes, <laughs> man. yes ding, that's got it. No, uh, you just, just decided how many hours you want to work. Uh, they say, they say on the platform, six hours, four hours, 30 hours, 
They specify. Mm -hmm. But you have to make the profile, right? You have to create your profile. Do you want to see my profile? No, uh, not think? yet. Huh? Yes. 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 Not yes. Yes. But yes, I was... yes. 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 Please, please, please. <laughs> Do you remember? Oh, we can copy. Remember yes, yes. you are the, the role model. No, uh, Vicente, he saw my profile and I yeah, put, right. I put um, $50 per hour. <laughs> yeah. Really? Vicente says, ah, únicamente 50 dólares la hora quiere, teacher. No se necesita inversión, teacher. No. No pay nothing. No, no. Ok, go okay. ahead. I can't. I can't, okay. uh, I can't Hoy no scare. dormiré. I can't scare, guys, because of the copyright. Sorry. Ok, don't worry. Yeah. But I, I try, I try only. But I put, I want to pay, I put, I want to receive $50 per hour. <laughs> hour. Oh my God. Yeah, that's what I put. <laughs> yeah. So you come, so you become a million, a millionaire man. Hey, hey, with my quality <laughs> service, is worth it. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. Mr. says, I'm rich man. That's right. That is correct. Now you can start with uh, working as a virtual assistant, right? Yes, VA, those pay $15, $20 an hour. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's look at the last activity for the day. It's going to be uh, 5.9. At the end of this class, participants will learn adjectives for describing personality traits. Al final de esta clase, los participantes aprenderán adjetivos para describir características de personalidad. Personality traits. Hello. Which of these adjectives are positive? Which are negative? Listen, repeat, and decide. Listen and repeat. But hello, which of these adjectives are positive? Which are negative? Listen, repeat, and decide. Listen and repeat. Bad tempered. Creative. Critical. Disorganized. Efficient. Forgetful. Generous. Hardworking. Impatient. Level-headed, moody, punctual, reliable, strict. Now get ready to listen to four conversations. Then check the adjective that best describes each person. Listen to four conversations. Then check the adjective that best describes... Okay, listen and repeat. Creative. 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 Please uh, stay silent because it's disturbing for the class. Okay. Okay. Uh, unfriendly. 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 Generous. 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 Strange. 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 Doctor. Moody. 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 Patient. 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 Hardworking. 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 Bad tempered. Bad tempered. Bad tempered. Disorganized. 
Reliable. Reliable. Uh, do you have any questions about the meaning of these words? No. Well, What's the meaning reliable? Uh, reliable is somebody that is reliable is, for example, I can say Vicente is reliable. Right, es una persona que hace lo que dice que va a hacer. That is a reliable person. Unreliable is the opposite. Okay. That you can trust in him. You can him. trust in their words. That's right. If they say to you, I will do something, they do it. Unreliable people have excuses. Oh, I can't. Oh, they give you 1,000 pesos and they don't. <laughs> excuses do. all time. They have excuses for everything. So that is unreliable. Unreliable. Okay. All right, okay, guys. Yeah, got it. I got to go. I got to go. It's been a pleasure. See you to See you. Okay. Have a nice night. Have a good night. night. Have a nice night. Have a good 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 night.